and my patches are an extension of my personality. <laughs> My brand is fun, um, humorous, uh, it's, it's aware of everything that's going on in the world. Everybody was kind of, it came to the end of the year and everyone was kind of making their final products and I just thought everyone's doing like 2D stuff so I was thinking what do I really like and I really like textiles and embroidery. So I sort of like ventured into the fashion department and used their machine. I find inspiration from a lot of things uh, like pop culture, films, music lyrics, cheesy wisdom that people give you. Um, clip art is like a huge um, inspiration to me. It starts with me drawing a pencil drawing of whatever the badge is um, and then I scan it in or at the moment I just take a picture of it on my phone. Put it on the computer and I have this embroidery software which is like really old school and 90s and it's quite like weird to use but I put it on there and that's where you can set all the stitch directions like the, the patterns all of that kind of thing and then I send it to my embroidery machine which you will see later um, and it stitches it out and that's it this is a good example of a strong message and it's basically it's got tones of feminism um, and it's just light-hearted and not taking yourself too seriously having fun and uh, just being a dick, basically. <laughs> so can you show us how you wear your patches? Yeah, sure. I actually have a few examples that I made earlier. Um, so obviously you could put on a cap. It's a bit baggy, but yeah. Um, a jacket. So I always recommend that people sew them on because they're more durable, but you can iron them on. Um, and you can go crazy or you can go minimal, whatever you like. Um, and then you can even put it on your backpack. I mean, this is probably too much. <laughs> but yeah, you've got the idea. I'd say there's quite a big Chinese and Japanese um, population of, that like my patches mm -hmm. because there's that kind of um, trashy, throwaway pop culture that they really like and buy into. Um, also, a lot of young, trendy, sort of hipster people quite like it. I had like an, a really old man from like a farm that bought one, you know, but on the whole, I'd say uh, all of the above. Um, yeah, I do think that my badges are a trend at the moment, which I like, but also I don't like because it's got a shelf life if it's a trend. Um, I didn't like seek for it to be a trend, but I think the reason it is a trend is because Literally everybody is doing it, Topshop, Urban Outfitters, everybody, and everyone's jumping on the bandwagon now, or the badge wagon, um, and it's good for me, I'm benefiting off it, but I'm always trying to think of the next thing because I know that it's going to die out like most trends. Um, I'd like to expand my brand, um, I don't want to just be known for patches because I actually have other things going on in my cooking pot. Um, and I'd like to sort of broaden it to clothing like hats and scarves and whatever but not just that I'd like to be more of an artist as well mm -hmm. and make sculptures and massive tapestries mm -hmm. all linking back to my brand if that's possible. 